Hello everybody, it's Joe here and welcome back to Tourist Bus Simulator. It's been so long since we've played this game, uh, but after my recent holiday down to Lanzarote, there was all these coaches whizzing about, taking people to and from the airport and to their holiday destinations, and I thought, do you know what? I absolutely want to go back on Tourist Bus Simulator. So I thought we'd take a return uh, to here. Now, I've already played through uh, the uh, the first, ver first uh, little bit where we've gone and bought a bus, because uh, I thought, you've seen that before, we don't need to do that. And uh, I've gone and bought myself a Scania Touring. Unfortunately, due to me getting a new computer a couple of weeks ago, uh, we don't have the old save that... Uh, I mean, I don't even think I had the old save anyway, but there we go. So I started again, bought this Scania. Looks beautiful, doesn't it? And uh, we're going to go into the office and, uh, and get ourselves sorted with, uh, with the task. No, hang on, go to the fax machine to get your first order. There we go. Yeah, we can do all that. So, new orders. Trip short from El Matoral to the airport. We'll get paid 500 euros for that. There we go. Open the calendar and skip time to your next appointment. There we go. Skip time to next appointment. That is on the 9th. Board your bus. Now, uh, obviously at this moment in time, I've only got one bus. Um, it's a shame... That they've still not, uh, you know, there's no AI buses rumbling about. That is a shame. It's one thing that I really don't like about this game. Um, firm bus, obviously you've got the, uh, on the motorway, you've got other buses rumbling about. It's just a shame about this game because I think it has so much potential. Um, I don't think, if I'm being perfectly honest with you, that there's any updates to this. I could be mistaken, but just having a look, it seems like such a long time since there was an update. I don't know if they're still updating it, whether they're doing anything with it. There we go, we'll just reverse out. Right, so, off we go. Where are we going? Uh, oh, we're off to the bus stop. El Matoral to the airport. Well, we can just about do that, because El Matoral is, uh, is just round the corner. There we go. Oh, it's got those uh, those fantastic Scania sounds. They've not actually linked it up, have they? It's just a sound. Um, you know, it doesn't actually seem to talk to what the bus is actually doing. You get the same every time you brake. Oh, hang on, there we go. You get that retarder sound. Right, off we go. Heck, there's a lot of people here. Flipping heck. Right, okay. Uh, the destination board needs to be active. Well, we put that on with Z. There we go, 11. And, uh, yeah, let's uh, let's open the doors and let them all on. Do you need me to open the luggage rack? No, nope, it doesn't appear that you do. Heck, there's, there's quite a lot of people, isn't there? Nearly going to be a full bus. Let's have a screenshot. You know I love a screenshot. Right, okay. Well, uh, hang on. How do I get out of my seat? Well, hello, everybody. Yep, yeah, we're, uh, we're off to the airport. You don't appear to have brought your luggage with you, so, you know, unless you're all just plain spotters that are on the day out. Uh, yeah, here we go. Fasten your seatbelts. Keep your masks on. Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot this was, uh, this was set before mask time, wasn't it? So, uh, none of them have got masks on. Never mind. Right, so away we go. So yeah, it's uh, it's it's a pretty straightforward run just to the airport and back, and uh, and then I guess we'll unlock more things, more journeys, more uh, you know, more places to go. There we go. We'll just take it nice and steady. There's no point rushing, is there? I ideally wanted to buy the uh, the comfort class. Uh, as my first bus, but unfortunately, because of the uh, the amount of funds you've got available to you, uh, the comfort class wasn't available to buy. Um, I've already crashed this bus because of uh, the flipping AI being useless. Ideally, I mean, when we were abroad, we got on uh, an, on an Iritha, 
Iriza, Iritha, I'm not really sure how you pronounce it, I think it's meant to be pronounced Iritha, but uh, you know what I mean, uh, the, the Scania coach, uh, but it wasn't a Scania, it was an Iritha on an MAN chassis. Are we going into this bus lane, there we go, lovely. Do we have to go round in the bus lane? I think we do, don't we? I mean, this here is very similar to Lanzarote Airport. It had the, the bays and then you just walk straight in. They're probably all very similar, aren't they? I mean, I know that from Flight Sim, uh, they are very similar. I think this is set on Fuerteventura, isn't it? One thing we did note as well is that the, uh, the, the buses don't seem to... Uh, adhere to the speed limit. You know, everyone. The, the speed limit is more of a more of a guideline. There we go. We'll just pop round here. There we go. So we've got lots of the MAN coaches that are sat in the bus station. I just it would be nice, wouldn't it, if you had the AI? You know, like I mean, I bought this add-on the Scania coach, Scania touring, it would be nice if this was, you know, if there were AI Scania tourings, you know, sat here, there we go, there we go, right, handbrake on, doors are open, Yeah, it'd be nice if there were Scania Torings parked up here, if there were Scania Torings whizzing about on the roads as you're going. You know, that would just be quite nice, wouldn't it? We, we don't seem to have that. It's just quite sad. I should really have uh, kicked them all off and then left them all on at the front, shouldn't I? There we go. I think that's, that's about everybody. In we go. Looking at my reverse camera, all is good. That's about all we need, isn't it? Alright, full steam ahead. Where are we going uh, next? Are we going back to El Matoral? 15 kilometres an hour. That's allegedly the speed limit in the bus station. I mean, heck, we actually do want to get there at some point. You know, these people have all just arrived off the plane. They want to get to their holiday destination. Oh, I quite like that yellow livery. It's nice, isn't it? Oh, look at that for a prime bit of corner in there. Lovely. Oh, that's when we need fuel. What's the uh, what's the fuel gauge looking like? I can't really see it on the dash. I think the steering wheel's in the way. Well, we'll we'll fuel the coach at some point. There we go. A bit of fifty. Oh yeah, I forgot there was a roundabout here. That's why there's a mini map in the corner, Joe, so you can see. Uh, so you can see where you're going. There we go, whizzing away. Right, get your foot down. Come on. We're nearly there. Get paid £500. Doesn't seem a lot, does it, really, for, for such a journey? Although I guess I, I don't know how much I bought this bus for. Did I buy it for £100,000? Something like that. Ooh, we're, we're going over the corner there. Going over the kerb. It's a shame that the... Uh, I mean, this map is a 1 to 10 scale of Fuerteventura. Uh, it's a shame it couldn't be like the full size map, I mean it'd take you quite a while to get from one end to the other. But it'd be really nice, wouldn't it? I'd, I'd absolutely love, like, because they're doing Berlin one to one, aren't they, at the minute, on uh, the bus. 
it would just be quite nice if tourist bus simulator had been on a bigger map so you could have done, you know, your excursions that have lasted longer, wouldn't they? Right, hang on, where are we going? We're just dropping off on this side of the road. Okay. All the passengers disembark. There we go. Well, they're all getting off. I think they are anyway. Yep, there we go. They all look like they're on the rolly bobs, don't they? Are we all off yet? Oh no, we're still working on it. It's taking your time, aren't you? I'm a bit surprised that, uh, you know, it didn't ask me to get off and do the luggage. Yeah, the indicators aren't very visible, are they? I wouldn't have known they were on if I hadn't told you. But there you go. Just flashing on the right hand side. There's the front one. Like? Oh, you can tell it's on at the front. It's a funny looking bus to scan here touring, isn't it? I don't dislike it. Oh yeah, I forgot, it's, uh, it's like the bus, isn't it, where one gets off at once. I think they've sorted that now with the bus. Um, yeah, it's just that there's not been any updates to this for quite a while, so I'm, I think the last thing that came out was on the 10th of February 2021, that was the, uh, the VDL double-decker. And we just don't seem to have had... Uh, oh, nobody's been left, good, good. Oh, hang on, what have I done? I've pressed F11, it's made it smaller. There we go. I meant to press F10, shut the back door. Yeah, so there's not been any updates in a year. So I kind of think, I mean, I know they've been working really hard on the bus. Roads are a bit tight, heck. Yeah, they have been working really hard at the bus, but it does kind of make me think, has this project been kind of abandoned now? Which would be a shame, I mean, I can't remember when this came out. Was it 2016, 2017? Right, go, go, go. Back to our depot. We're flying, absolutely flying down here. There we go. There we go, we'll park at a bit of an angle. There we go, park in the yard and exit your vehicle. Right, get that door open. First employee. Oh yeah, I remember we hired someone last time and she crashed my bus, didn't she? Right, hang on. Right, here we go. Into the... Oh, hang on, where are we? Into the next room. File on the desk. Yep, employees. Who have we got? Uh, all employees. Job market. Right. So, uh, yeah, 8 out of 10, uh, out of 100, heck, we don't want to, 1 out of 100, you know, you, you're you not very good, are you, really? Right, so reliability, that's probably what we're looking at, I mean, reliability, they've got 78.6 out of 100, Benty Borman, I mean, you star, you're not reliable, but you've got a high star. Yeah, Benty Borman, you're, uh, you're hired. There we go. You're going to be working from tomorrow. Fantastic. There we go. Ready from tomorrow. Go to the calendar and skip the time ahead. Oh, we appear to have walked into the cupboard. There we go. Head out the right door. Can we not put some lights on in this office? Right, there we go. Go to the calendar and skip the time. To the next day... What is it? What is it telling me to do? Go to the calendar and skip time to the next day. Right, okay. There we go. We'll just we'll just skip to Friday at 7 a.m. There we go. They've arrived and are now available. Get a new order again. Okay, so this will be me this time. Uh, yeah, orders. What have we got? New orders. Uh, El Matarol to the airport. I mean... Do we want to do that again? Go to the pin board and open the schedule. 
Are we sending him on this? I think we are, aren't we? There we go. Change driver and vehicle. Benty Borman in the Scania. There we go. Open the calendar and skip two days forward. Skip time to Sunday. Need your vehicle. Do you want to return the vehicle? Yes, we do. There we go. So Benty Borman has uh, had an accident for crying out loud. Right, he's had an accident. Uh, order's been successfully completed. Now open fleet management in the vehicles menu. Is that is that in here? Yeah. Uh, yeah, he crashed the bus for crying out loud. Right, so we want that bus back. Now get a new order for myself. There we go. So this is a permanent order. So does this happen every day? So line 22. I've completely forgotten this. It's been so long since we've played it, isn't it? El Matarral to Castillo Caleta de Fusta. Fusta, Fusta. It's a short trip. There we go. Reopen the schedule and assign a vehicle. Uh, with me as the driver. Right, we can do that. Uh, so, I'll be driving, and we'll be taking the Scania Touring that Benty Borman very kindly crashed for us. There we go. Do we have to skip time again? Heck. We'll just skip to the next appointment. There we go. Right, follow the route. So we're off. Permanent route, uh, permanent order, sorry. In the Scania. Oh, look how smashed in bits it looks. Doesn't look that bad, actually. Just a bit, you know, just a little bit damaged. Right, okay. Uh, yeah. Load. I'll start even. Destination. Oh, no, that's that's getting out. F9 closes your door. Yeah, lovely. Headlights with L. Air conditioning with G. We're off. I hope I don't reverse into whatever that is. There we go. Right, where are we going? So, El Matarral. That's where we're going. Oh, we're going to the, the regular pickup just down here. It's quite useful. It's just near the depot, isn't it? I've not got any nice screenshots, have I? Would you say that was a nice screenshot? I don't know. It's a screenshot. Right, there we go. Let's just go straight across. I know it's a stop. But, you know, we're in a bigger bus. We're, our bus is bigger than you, so you will stop for us. That's uh, that's how we're running this show. Way right round we go. Right, round and in. There we go. Come on then, guys. On you get. We're, uh, what time do we leave? I mean, it says 7.50. What time is it now? Oh, no. Is, is that what time it is now? Yeah. Hello. Yeah, nobody's Spanish, are they? They're all English. Well, they're on the rolly bobs, aren't they? Right, okay. Yeah. Get that door shut. Where are we actually going? Let's press M and get the map loaded. So we're going down to... Oh, just down to the next town. And then back again. Oh, okay. That uh, seems straightforward enough. Righty out. So we're going down. Oh yeah, we're going the same way as if we were going to the airport, and then you turn right, don't you? We could do with being reliveried, couldn't we? Rather than just plain white, we could do with like changing our livery into something else. I don't know what livery we could pick. Right, okay. Yep, right. Yep, nobody's coming. Let's just go straight round. And full steam ahead. You need to get a bit of speed up here because you're joining the main road. Or is this where you join the main road and they all slam on? Is that the one? Yeah, right, off we go. Yeah, yeah, there's always a car just waiting to pull out in front, isn't there? 
there we go. Let's uh, let's have a bit of speed control. Uh, speed control. Speed set. And it's weird because there are quite a few roads like this, you know, in Lanzarote. I thought that they were a bit unrealistic, like, oh yeah, that's a bit steep, you know, you'd never get a bus whizzing up there. And you actually do. I mean, this, la this barren landscape is just so realistic, it really is. I didn't appreciate it until I actually went to the, uh, I mean, I've been to Tenerife, but until I went to the Canary Islands, as in Lanzarote, Tenerife doesn't seem quite as barren. You know, it's, uh, it seems to be a bit more... Oh, we've discovered a hardware store. Right, okay. Now we'll just keep plodding on. There's no point rushing us, so we'll just take our time. go right into, uh, I can't even remember the name of the place where we're going. Ah, there we go, straight round. Look at that, I'm not a bad little cook. Caleta de Fusta, that's where we're going. It's these junctions that play out with me, because like now, the Audi is a little bit close. We're just going to go, beep beep, coming through. But the oh nearly, nearly. Oh, I've gone the wrong way. Flipping heck. Yeah, you were you were meant to go past this. Oh well, we'll go up here and just see what's up here. You know, people are on the holidays. They want to see the local sites. We'll go down. Uh, no, do you know what? We'll go up to the top. Because I think there's something up here. What's up here? Oh, nothing. Is it a hotel? I don't know what it is. It's like apartments, isn't it? Oh well, we'll just uh, we'll just drive round and then back down again. Ah, what's this? It's a bus stop. Yeah, I thought we'd maybe unlock some some hotels, some apartments that we can drop off at, but never mind. Yep. Okay, Joe went the wrong way. It happens to the best of us. Ah, right, okay. Have we, uh, have we hit... Yeah, we've not hit anybody, but this is, uh, this is the problem with Taurus Bus. He wants to turn right, and he's stuck. Right, okay. Uh, so we're going to have to just perform an illegal move, aren't we? Because otherwise we're going to be here all day. Yeah, we've hit that car, never mind, keep going round, and down we go. Now I remember why I fell out with this game, flipping heck. Oh, you're not going to go, you're just going to stop there. Right, okay. Uh, yeah, you've not given me a lot of manoeuvrability room there, if I'm honest. Right, there we go. So we'll turn left, and then we'll turn left again. Oop. Yeah, they could kind of do with overhauling this game, like, good and proper, couldn't they? There we go. Stop. Oh, hang on, I'm putting it not in full screen mode again. It's not F11 for your doors, Joe. That's, uh, that's the bus where F11 does all your doors. Hello, good morning. They get on a lot quicker than they get off, don't they? There we 
we go, we'll get the back door shut. Right, off we go, back towards El Mataral, El Mataro. Take this corner nice and wide. There we go. Ooh, Steakhouse Aberdeen discovered. Sounds like just the sort of place you would have in uh, in in Spain. The Steakhouse Aberdeen. There we go. Take this corner. Try and not get on the curb. I think I did, but the Barcello Fuerteventura. There was a Barcello hotel not too far from where we were staying, actually. So where are we going? Just back to El Mataral? Yeah, okay, I can do that. So with this being a, a permanent order, this will be like every day that we'll do this? Once a day or more than once a day? There we go. It's a shame they don't do like inter-urban buses. I think, well they do, don't they? Because they've got the Manline City inter-urban uh, that you can buy. I don't actually have that add-on, but for like... Um, because again, in Lanzarote, they have uh, they've got the Iris bus, interurban buses. You can get them on Omsi, and the Ivecos, the newer versions. It'd be nice for like the intertown running. You know, if it's a permanent order, if you could, we could use something smaller. Maybe I need to dip my hand in my pocket and uh, invest in the interurban bus. I mean, it depends. I don't know how much we're going to do on uh, Taurus Bus Simulator, obviously I've not done a video in it in a while. You know, if it proves popular and people watch it, then of course I shall uh, I shall do more Taurus Bus. If I put this video out and everyone's like, oh, I don't know why you've done that because it's, you know, it's a bit terrible. Then, uh, let's get a nice picture, there we go. There we go, That's, uh, that is the money shot. Oh, I've just hit someone. That's because when you're going round roundabouts, before you start, or before you enter the roundabout, you should really look at who's on the roundabout, i.e. look left and right. Yeah, okay, that was my fault, I accept responsibility. Yeah, so uh, if if it turns out that Taurus Bus Sim is quite popular, then I'll do more videos on it. But like I say, if uh, if you guys don't bother watching it, then uh, this will probably just be a one return trip. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Right, there we go, so we need to go down to the, uh, way, right, so, anybody come in? No, right, off we go. Straight round and back up. There we go, look at that, professional coach driver me. He says until he comes up to this junction way too fast, there we go. Take it nice and steady. No rush, look at that, brilliant. Go straight round and back into El Mataral. I'm assuming we've got paid for that. Yeah. Do you know what? I quite enjoyed my trip on uh, on Taurus Bus Simulator today. Today. Put my teeth in. Try again. And I hope that you did too. If you have enjoyed today's video, please do click that like button. And of course, if you haven't already, do subscribe. Like I said, depending on how this video performs, uh, does depend on, of course, whether we will be coming back to this. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll see, we'll see. It's always worth trying uh, trying things, isn't it? Uh, but yes, thank you so much for watching, and uh, hopefully I shall see you all next time. Cheerio. Goodbye for now.